guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a Generation Beauty swag haul for you guys. This is an event that's hosted a few times a year by Ipsy and Ipsy OS. And this year they were nice enough to invite me as a creator, which was so amazing and I'm so thankful for that opportunity. I got so much stuff and I just wanted to kind of show you guys. I was showing you previews on my Snapchat and my Instagram over the weekend. And so many of you said, please, please film a haul for us. We want to see what you got. So that's what I'm gonna be doing today. There is a ton of stuff. I will be including some of these items in an upcoming giveaway because some of them are duplicates of things that I already have. And there's so much stuff that I'm gonna try and go through everything as quickly as possible. Um, I'll give you guys a little bit of detail, but unless we want this to be like a four hour long video, we kind of need to go a little bit quicker today so I can show you everything. So let's jump right in. So the Friday night before the event, Ipsy usually hosts a creator cocktail party. And if you go, you get one of these giant swag bags full of stuff. This thing has to weigh like 20 or 30 pounds. It has the Generation Beauty logo on the back and then it just says from Ipsy with love on the front with these really cute lips. This bad boy is ginormous. So let's open it up. The first thing in here is a brush set by Royal and Langnickel. I've never heard of them before, but I'm definitely gonna be trying them out and I will let you guys know what I think. And then also in here is a Tardis Pro Lash Paint Mascara. I've been dying to try this ever since I saw it on their Instagram and a lot of other beauty creators have been reviewing it as well. So I'm super excited for that. Also in here is a Their Real Mascara from Benefit. Benefit's one of my favorite brands of all time. I'm actually, this is not my favorite mascara by Benefit. I like the Their Real ones better. So I'll probably give this one away in the giveaway. Also in here is Pixie by Petra. Oh, this is an amazing mascara. This is their Large Lash Mascara in Bold Black. I love how fluffy this brush is. It just makes my lashes like absolutely ginormous. This is the Pure Lease Blue Lotus 4-in-1 Cleansing Milk. It says that it gently cleanses skin, it removes makeup, tones, and soothes, and that it is sulfate-free. Also in here is a permanent pout lip product by Pop Beauty in the color Power Pink, and it says that it is a matte lip paint. I'm all about that matte lip lately for some reason. I used to be all about the shiny lips, and now I'm all on the matte craze. Another lip product in here is the Milani Amore Metallics Lip Cream. This is actually really pretty. This is in the color Materialistic, and it's a really gorgeous copper color that'll be perfect for fall. And then this looks like a Laneige water sleeping mask. I actually got this um, in a bag, I think last year and I've used it all up. This is really great, especially if you have dry skin. And since I'm now on that dry skin train right now, this will be perfect. There's a few products from Physicians Formula. The first one is their new Super BB Insta Ready Cream. It looks like this. I love BB creams. I love the Tarte one, so I'm super excited to try this one. I just feel like BB creams for me make my makeup so much easier, especially on those days when I'm trying to just run out the door and still look somewhat put together. And then this actually saved the day, you guys. I was so prepared for Generation Beauty and all the events, and yet I somehow managed to forget one thing, and that one thing was my Kat Von D Shade and Light Contour Palette. So I literally had no contour for the entire weekend. So when they gave us this bag Friday night, I was like, yes, honey. This is the new Physicians Formula Contour Trio BB Stick. Now it's out of the package, because like I said, I've already used it. I hope you guys can see this on camera. It is so neat. So you have your darkest contour color on the bottom, a medium one in the middle, and then more of a lighter kind of highlight shade at the top. And all you do is take this stick and kind of glide it like that over your face on each side and then blend it out. It's like foolproof contour and highlight. I cannot say enough amazing things about this. And they actually make this in a blush stick as well, which I really like. And I'm gonna show you guys that in a minute. So moving on to skincare items. This one is Derma E. This is their Purifying Daily Detox Scrub. I actually already use this and I love it. It's a really great product. Um, I actually keep a bottle of it in my shower, so once I run out now, I have a backup. And then this is the Skin Fix Rough and Bumpy Renewing Cream. It says it is clinically proven to smooth dry, rough, and bumpy skin. 96% natural. I've heard such amazing things about this line. I've actually seen them a lot recently at all of my drugstores. When I was talking to the rep, she basically was telling me how all of their products are made to treat problem skin. So if you have dry skin or eczema or psoriasis or any type of skin condition, they basically have something for everyone, which I think is amazing. I'm actually gonna try this on Mia because she gets a little bit of eczema on her elbows sometimes, and this might be really great for that. And then I thought this was a really cool concept. This is the Vital Proteins Collagen Peptides. This is a collagen powder and when you drink it, you can put it in your tea, your coffee, um, your water, whatever you want. You can even sprinkle it on food. Collagen basically helps to reduce any fine lines, wrinkles, it plumps up your skin so you look more youthful. And the biggest selling point for me was that it helps with your makeup application because when your skin's healthier, it looks better, it feels better. Applying your makeup is way easier. Also in here is a little bag from NYX that looks just like this. Let me open this bad boy up. There's a lot of stuff in here. So the first thing I see is the NYX Pigments. This one is in a really cool gunmetal color. And then this one is more of a deep mauve purple. And then there's two, a, I think these are lip products. 
Yeah, this one is the Plush Gel Lipstick, and this one is a kind of nude shade, and then this one is their red shade. These look really cool. I've never tried these. I didn't even know NYX had that. And then this is a Lip of the Day. This is kind of like a lip art pen, I guess you would say. It's in this really cool, like, orange color. This one is called Hex Sort. And then last but not least in here is the Love Contours All NYX Professional Makeup Palette. And then within this bag, there's a whole other bag that is from Bon Vivant, which is a mask company. This one is a green clay mask, a pink clay mask, and then a volcanic ash mask, which is super exciting. I'm really, I'm kind of digging this one. Like I want to dig into it now. And then they gave us these really cute headbands to wear when we put our masks on just to keep our hair out of our face. This one's a little bear, which I thought was super cute. They gave us their Spray It Clean Dry Shampoo. They did a demonstration on me at Generation Beauty with this. I am obsessed. You guys know I'm always on the hunt for a new dry shampoo. That is the DHC Deep Cleansing Oil. This is amazing. I actually had to use this as well when I was at Generation Beauty because somehow I forgot my makeup remover. Like, I don't know what happened this trip. I could have sworn I was so prepared and it just didn't happen. And Luxie gave us five of their new face brushes. I'm obsessed with these. I have so many Luxie brushes back there and I actually showed them in my recent How to Clean Your Brushes video. So this one is the 532 Top Round Blender. I love this one for applying foundation. This one is the 530 Flat Top Kabuki. And then we have the Angled Top Buffer number 534. This one is the Pointed Top Kabuki 536. And then the Angled Blender 538. From SL Miss Glam is this L34 Blending Brush in this really gorgeous purple color. I have two mascaras here. I can never have enough. I seriously have an entire drawer that's dedicated to nothing but mascaras. This is the Crown Brush Volumizing one. And then this is the Pure Cosmetics Triple Threat Slimline Mascara. Also in here is an eyeshadow palette from Shea Moisture. They just launched their makeup line. So I'm super excited to try this. I'll let you guys know what I think. And then this is the Bomb La Bomba eyeshadow palette. In here you get four different shades, a really pretty forest green, a gorgeous like sparkly brown color, a kind of more blending neutral brown matte shade, and then a sparkly kind of champagne color right here. And then last but not least in here is a makeup bag from Jouer. It's really cute, it's a pink and gold bag. When you open it up, there's a little bag inside of it, and then there's also five of their new little makeup brushes, which I thought was really cute. And then within the little Jouer bag itself, you got their new um, Glisten Brightening Powder. I've never tried this, that'll be fun. And then they gave us four of their lip creams, which I am obsessed with. I have a bunch back there if you guys can see them. This one is in the color Noisette, Citronade Rose, Cassie, and Buff. Buff is like my holy grail nude lip color. I actually ordered three of them before I left for Gen Beauty because I'm always afraid that they're gonna sell out. So if you guys are looking for a really great like natural nude color, Buff is your jam. So that was everything from the Friday night swag bag. And then I wanted to show you guys also what I got on Saturday. So on Saturday, I was able to walk around and meet so many of the PR reps for the brands that were there. They were so sweet and so generous to me. I cannot thank them enough. It was the most amazing experience, you guys. The first place that I went was GHD, and they gave us this giant bag full of stuff. It's insane. I mean, I'm not a small person, and this bag is like half my size. It's crazy. And then in here, we got their hair serum, as well as two of their hair brushes. This one is the paddle brush, which I love, and then the oval dressing brush. Paddle brushes are life to me. Like, I cannot use, I cannot live without them. Like, my hair is such a mop that without a paddle brush, I'll literally spend an entire day just trying to work the knots out of my hair. And then they gave us their Copper Luxe Collection Platinum Styler Premium Gift Set. I have been stocking this on the Sephora website since I can't tell you when, and I almost bought it in the Sephora VIB Rouge sale. Luckily, I didn't, because no, I have one. This is so cute. So it comes in this little like cute gift set pouch looking thing. It's like this black fabric with copper trim on the sides. And then the flattening iron itself is this gorgeous copper color with bronze plates. And it also comes, where to go? This little hot pocket thing. So you can put it on the ends when you're not using it. So it like doesn't damage anything else that's around. I thought that was a really cute idea. It also comes with two nail polishes and a bronze and a copper color. And then the thing that I'm most excited about is this Curve GHD styling iron. It's this tapered curling iron that I've never like, I've never tried anything like it before, but when they demonstrated with it at the event, I was like, I need that. Like the curls looked perfect. Like I don't even know how to perfectly describe them, but they were, they weren't too like tight and they weren't too loose. They were like that perfect, like second day hair look almost. It was so gorgeous. Like I wanted to stalk the girl who they did her hair because I just wanted to like stare at it. It was so pretty. So I want to kind of do an entire review on this. Let me know if that's something you guys are interested with all of these GHD products because I would love to film that for you. Next I went to the Rock Your Hair booth and I got another of the dry shampoo as well as a mini version of it. They also gave us the volumizing hairspray. 
their Rock Your Hair Bombshell Big Hair Powder, which I'm all about that volume life. And then the Rock Your Hair Leave-In Conditioner, which again, I can't live without leave-in conditioner. I mean, I literally cannot brush my hair without it. Like, that's not an exaggeration whatsoever. And then this is the Hot Curls Thermal Curl Spray. They were really nice. I got to meet Michael, who's the owner. He is the cutest, sweetest person I literally have ever met in my life. And it was really sweet of him. Like, instead of just handing me random products, he actually took the time to kind of analyze my hair, touch it, feel it, and see what products would be best for me. So I thought that was really special. And then this bag of awesomeness right here is from The Balm. They were so sweet. So they gave us two palettes. The first one is the Balm Appetit palette. This one is so cute. The packaging is super unique. I love the shades, especially this mauve one right here. They also gave us the Meat Matte, I think it's Trimony palette. Sorry if I'm butchering that. These shadows are so gorgeous. They're super pigmented. They're super creamy. I love this um, matte, what is it, matte Moskowitz palette. And then this matte Kumar shade right here. I think they're both really pretty. I cannot fucking speak. And then this bag of awesomeness right here is from The Balm. They gave us a ton of stuff to try. This one is the Balm Appetit palette. The packaging on this is so cute. And this flips down just so you guys know, so it's easier to kind of get your brush in there. The shades are so unique. They're like nothing else I've ever seen. They also gave us the Meat Matte, I think it's Trimony palette. These two shades right here, Matte Kumar, Matte Moskowitz, are so gorgeous. I love these blending shades up here. I especially love Matte Evans and Matte Lynn up here. They also gave us their Schwig Black Liquid Eyeliner, their Hot Mama Bronzer, their Mad Lash Black Noir Mascara. They gave us a mini set of their Lasting Liquid Lipsticks. These are super cute. You get six different shades in here. And then um, Sharona from The Balm, she was so, so sweet. And I kept asking her, I was like, what is on your lips? It is so gorgeous. And she said it was this color Sincere. So she gave me a full size of that one. That was so, so nice of her. And then these are Time Bomb Foundations. They were talking about how if you have acne or a lot of redness or discoloration, that these are super full coverage and they will pretty much cover anything. I got two different shades to try out so I'll let you guys know what I think. This one is light and then this one is lighter than light. I have really fair skin so I think these are gonna be perfect. And then last but not least, they gave us Mary Luminizer, which I'm super excited about because I feel like I'm pretty much the only person left in the makeup community who doesn't own this. I just think it's so gorgeous. like. Oh my goodness, look how pretty that is. Like it's such a soft, natural glow. Like I'm just gonna like quickly touch up my glow, don't mind me, just, just glowing over here. Are you gelling? Cause I'm gelling. And then besides this stuff they gave us in the swag bag, Shea Moisture also gave us a bag of stuff at the actual event. In here is two bottles of their 10 in one renewal system shampoo and conditioners. There's also a energizing bubble bath and body wash, which I love, I actually already own this in the full size. And then this is the Smooth and Tame Blowout Cream. I always need blowout cream because I feel like my frizziness is just on a whole nother level lately. Like it's it's something else. And then this is their new lipstick in the color Poppy. And this is a shea butter based lipstick. So it's supposed to be super duper moisturizing. Kirlis gave me another bottle of their Blue Lotus 4-in-1 Cleansing Milk. Their Nourishing Daily Lip Butter with Mango and Shea. Their Blue Lotus 4-in-1 I Adore Serum, and then their Prevent Blue Lotus Balancing Moisturizer. Besides the water sleeping mask, Laneige also was nice enough to give me this really cute pink refillable water bottle. And then from Physicians Formula, they gave me the Super BB Insta Ready Powder, the BB Cream, another one, and then a Super BB Ready, um, they call this a contour stick, but I call it the blush stick because the shades are all very much blush colors. I think this is so cute. I've actually used this one too. I love that it gives you three different shades all mixed in one because when you blend them together, it's just, it's so, so pretty. Joy also gave us this long wear lip cream in the color lychee and then their essential lip enhancing treatment, which I adore. And then at the next booth, they gave us this really cute little like passport book and their new uh, Madrid Wanderlust palette. In here you get eight shadows and then one of their deep red lip creams. Then last but not least was Milani. They gave us this giant bag of stuff, which was so, so sweet of them. There are so many things in here. Okay, so the first few things are these Stay Matte um, Felt Tip Ultra Thin Liners. This one is in a safari green color and this one is in their classic black. I'm excited to try this one because my wings lately just, they need help. Like hopefully this will do the trick, you know? And then there, oh my gosh, this is insane. Okay, I don't even know how to show you guys all of these. There are an insane amount of lip products in here. Look how, look at this. How crazy is that? Okay, so let me just pick out a few of my favorites to show you guys. So this one is number 28 Darling, and this is their Amore Matte Lip Cream. And then what's another one that I really like? They're also pretty, I'm having a hard time deciding. And then this one is number 30 Honey. This one is another matte. Clearly I'm on the matte lip train lately. Let me pick out a shimmery one just so you guys can see. This one is in Chromatic Addict. This is a really pretty like, pink with a, I'd say a gold undertone of sparkle to it. 
And then another sparkly one that I really, really love would probably be, there's too many choices, I love them all. This one is number 18, Obsession. Like, how gorgeous is this hot pink purple color? That is all I have for today. Make sure to let me know what you guys thought of this video in the comments down below. If you did go to Gen Beauty, please leave me a comment. Let me know what you thought of it, what you got. I'd love to know and talk to you guys. As always, thank you so much for watching, and I will talk to you next time. delirious and sketch in my outer corner with faded kind of blended in between them and then on the inner corner I'm wearing this really pretty silver iced color right here